Hi, I'm Paweł Spychalski. Today is uh, one of the first sunny and not so cold or wet days in the last few weeks and also one of the last days of the year 2020. And today it's time for, for me to finally maiden my first 3D printed, yes, 3D printed aeroplane I mentioned at least a few times on this channel already. So first, uh, let me show you how this thing looks like just a few minutes before maiden and then let's see if it actually flies. Everybody says it should be flying, but well, I'm kind of afraid that on the first touchdown to the ground it will just Anyway, uh, the only way to know that for sure is to test it. So, let's go. That is the Goblin. As you can see, it looks, well, almost like an airplane. It has a wing, a negative swept wing. It has the long nose, just like, well, usually the airplanes with the negative swept wings. Some stabilizers, a motor and a kind of big... Uh, nose orange. Uh, this is a TPU. This part is printed with the TPU in case it's really like, you know, so not to replace the nose after every ending. And below this nice canopy, I have all the bits and pieces internally. I wanted to make this plane in the as a first idea just to line of sight, no flight controller, only the receiver wire to the servos and to the motor. But then decided, well, yeah, maybe if I can do it, I will just slap a flight controller, slap a camera into the nose. The uh, the VTX, which is an edge intake, so five. Uh, we have over here the Matek F405 or something like that, a LiPo. Uh, this one uh, you will not see right now because uh, I'm also testing right now the receivers from the Radio Master. This is the R161, the small receiver with only S bus and uh, smart port outputs, no, no, no analog channels, no, no, no PWM channels, and after putting this uh, the battery into this thing it even balances on the center of gravity which is over here really very 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 in the front but I say it should be over there so and now I will put the GoPro on my head and I will plug in the battery and we will see if this thing really flies. Uh, the manual says, actually not the manual says, the author of this uh, design, uh, Przemek, told me that the reflex on the uh, elevons should be around 3 millimeters. We'll, we'll see how this will work. And I will plug the LiPo over here. It's nicely protected with the foam and hopefully it will not shift during the flight. And we will see if it really works. Okay, canopy installed. Uh, let's check the center of mass. Ooh, no, 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 no. Um, two nose heavy. Definitely two nose heavy. I will have to move the battery slightly back. Uh, so let's move it back like... Uh, this is broken. Okay, uh, now it should be better. Now it should be better. Yeah. Now it should be better, now the canopy is in a perfect place and the battery is in a perfect place and we can try throwing this thing into the air. The first flight will be of course line of sight, mainly because I had the camera on my head and it's really hard to... Okay... Um, okay... Let's select model, goblin, uh, yeah, experimental version, okay, and okay, timers are off, but this is not relevant, the main thing that we should have the aileron movements, let's make the high five test, correct, 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 okay, so there is nothing really for me to do, but to go a few meters that direction, turn on the motor and let's see if this thing flies. Just a second ago there was some wind, but now it's over, so maybe even we will be able to see if this thing flies. I wonder how I should throw it, huh. like that? Um, Nah, I will just throw it like that or like that. Bloody hell, I have no idea how to throw this thing now. Okay, but that's... Uh, I will just do the 
I will just try to throw it like that. I should somehow survive. Okay, so uh, armed motor is on. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. That definitely was not a successful launch and I wonder what got destroyed. Yeah. Okay. Surprisingly wing is almost Ah, no, wing is not okay. I think even the carbon reinforcement over here uh, snapped in the half. So no, the wing is scrapped. The fuselage surprisingly is in the much better condition that I expected. Uh, I still cannot say it's in a good condition. Uh, I wonder if it really makes sense to try to repair it. Uh, the wing, okay, the wing snapped over this. Well, the fuselage is probably repairable. Um, but everything else, not. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, I really don't know what to say. I really, for a second, I expected this thing will be flying. Uh, it was climbing pretty nice, but then probably I put not enough throttle and it just stalled somewhere in the middle of the process and you've seen what happened. I had absolutely no authority to pull up when it just went down, so uh, okay. Um, I think we can officially say that this project is scrapped. Maybe I will print another one, maybe I will not print another one. I have no bloody idea yet. I have all the parts, at least most of the parts, uh, even the carbon rods. So we will see, we will see. Oh, well, 